Awesome Mel here. Hope you're all having a great day. Today I decided to make a video on the topic concerning what do nurses do. Believe it or not, this question has been requested by many of you. A lot of people don't know what nurses do. And I've gotten this question ever since I got accepted into nursing school three and a half years ago and as I became a registered nurse this year. But then the question is usually followed with, do you wipe bums? Are you a slave to the doctor? Why would you ever want to be a nurse? Can't anyone just be a nurse? Okay, so we're just going to dive into this topic. Nurses are trained professionals in caring for patients who are sick. However, what makes our profession different than any other profession in the healthcare system is that we treat not only the patient's medical diagnosis, but we treat the person holistically, their social aspects, what makes them themselves. It goes a lot more in depth than just what they present with at the hospital. Nurses work under their own scope of practice. They are trained to assess, evaluate. They have their own types of diagnoses as well. And it goes hand in hand as well with what the doctor assesses, evaluates, and what the doctor prescribes in medications. I'm going to say this once, and I'm going to say it along the course of this video and probably in many other videos to follow. Nurses work collaboratively with other professionals in the hospital field or in the healthcare field, clinic field, whichever setting it is. It's not a one woman, one man show. We work collectively together to give the best possible care to a patient. We work with doctors, we work with nutritionists, dietitians, pharmacists, social workers, respiratory therapists, and this is all collaboratively done to give the best possible care to a patient. The reason why we work with so many healthcare professionals is that we are trained to treat the patient holistically. The important role in the hospital field is that of a PAB. This is a patient bedside assistant, and it is vital to a nurse, and more importantly, to the patient. A PAB is someone who aids the patient in toileting, mobilizing, um, self-hygiene, very crucial for a person's self-esteem while in the hospital. However, if a patient has an accident concerning toileting, I'm not going to have my patient sit there if a PAB is not present. I'm going to go help and clean up the patient myself because I don't believe that any patient, any person should be sitting in their own bodily fluids without any help. But that's me. And I believe that nurses in general do that as well. To clarify, Nursing is not a glamorous job, but it is the most rewarding job. Knowing you get to go into work every day and touch so many hearts and get to be a part of a patient's journey in recovery or a patient's journey in diagnosis is truly fulfilling. This is not a job for everyone. I truly believe that nursing is a calling and it is a passion. In order to do this line of service, you need to be dedicated to it 110%, meaning that before you go to work, before you enter the hospital doors, you need to leave everything happening in your own personal life at home, leave it at the door. When you're going in for the next 8 hours, 12 hours, sometimes 16 hours, depending if you're picking up a double shift, you need to be 110% present with your patient and alert in giving the best possible care. I have about three years of clinical stage experience and six months working independently as a nurse. I say independently, but once again, we work collaboratively all together. On day shift, sometimes you're given six patients and on evening, sometimes 10, but you're working with an LPN. You have to do assessments, administer medications, pills, intravenous, sometimes hanging up um, blood transfusions. Your job is to pick up on the slightest cues and alterations in a patient in order to save them from something detrimental happening. That is why I say this is not a job for anyone. Nurses rarely take breaks. I rarely take my breaks or never take a full break. However, I am sure with more experience, it will come a little easier. But in no way, shape, or form is nursing con is remotely considered an easy field. I want to leave you off with this. Be kind to your nurses. They truly put you and your families first before anyone, including themselves. They spend more time with you than their own children, friends, family, their husbands and wives. They are superheroes, but in scrubs. 
So that is briefly scratching the surface of what nurses do. I really hope you enjoyed this video. I hope to release more videos. Be sure to share this video with friends and family that you think would enjoy it. That is all everyone. I'm wishing you a great rest of the day and stay healthy.